Good morning guys Today is the 1st of October And I'm going to the Alps for two days the most, Riding the most beautiful passes And you are going to join me And this is all I need Let's get ready It's 9.19 in the morning I don't know if you're gonna hear something different with uh, Krapovic. You tell me. I feel the difference. It's really nice. We have 120 or something kilometers till uh, the Alps. 20 minutes till Switzerland. Oh, there's a balloon here. Hot air balloon. And yeah. We need like maybe one and a half hours, two hours till the Alps and then I will ride only the passes, the small secondary roads but till Zurich I think we will go on the Autobahn on the highway Let's go to the Alps! Last time this year I think, but what a year it was Ah, oh, so many trips with a motorcycle Yeah, in Zurich We are planning to move here maybe one day in a few years after we finish we are doing some extra curricular and some extra hours of therapy to be able to practice here in Switzerland also so let's see Zurich is beautiful and so close to the Alps now the beautiful passes start not like it was ugly before but now it's gonna be really beautiful ah, My heart in the Alps, my soul is like oh. Just like paradise This is Klausen Pass, very beautiful Not a little detour but it's worth it It's like a lot of drinks later, we'll see It's totally walking Look at the views Autumn is, autumn is different Different views Look how beautiful it is The snow, the waterfalls Look, oh, the valley A dream It's a total different way of traveling and going to the passes also with the Teneri because of the 21 front wheel you cannot go too fast you know in the corners like with the NC with the 70 inch and you're more slowly more safe and you just enjoy the view you know you go slow look at everything enjoy the nature it's a different way of tra traveling I like it Of course you can go fast But not as fast as With 19 inch or 17 inch The detour was totally worth it, don't you think? Usually there is a waterfall here In the spring But not now Let's Take a break here Just beautiful, no? Just beautiful Just to show you the spot Where we're gonna have lunch Look at this This is paradise This is Paradise and it's so close To home I don't know if I showed you my new black bark busters, not the yellow one anymore. Also black belly pen. 
to protect the engine and the new Akrapovic not new new for me it's a used one I bought it cheap so this is the new new things let's get off this close and I don't have tuna but I have some sandwiches let's go the bike is over there it's the Klausen Pass and I'm sitting here next to the river eating not a tuna but a sandwich with some tomatoes so it's not too dry and then we go to Susten Pass and to Fulka and to Grimsel and to Nufenen. Let's see. Maybe we will skip one because it's getting dark really early. Okay guys, enjoy the view. Pass. Also very beautiful. But if you come, if you ever come to Susten Pass, I will show you one little road. It's so beautiful, it's not believable. We will see in a moment. This is unreal. So awesome. There's a gletscher, no? Definitely go here. It's so beautiful. Pass. It's getting dark already. It's October. Beautiful. You can see it. The Hotel Belvedere, but we are not going there, we are going to the hotel first. Because I have to check in between 4 pm and 6 pm, and it's 5 pm now. So perfect. I think I will go there in the evening because the sun is there, so it will be fine. I will just check in and then go to this place. We are in the village where the hotel is. Let's see if we find it really fast. Okay. 
Schlüssel. This is tiny room for 90 euros. Crazy. And the TV is not working. I never watch TV, but when you pay 90 and the TV is not working. Funny. But I have my bathroom. <laughs> so this is the room. At least you have a view at the mountain. A little bit. <laughs> okay, let's get ready. Okay, let's go. We have a little bit more than one hour left because it's almost six and the sunset is seven or seven. Let's go enjoy the last sunlight but on the mountain it's maybe higher so it's later which is closed due to the falling rocks from the mountains <laughs> Salvador de Bahia, they did this. It was really nice, I think, applauding the day. What an awesome day it was. Let's go get some gas and go to the hotel. What an awesome day. I arrived in the village. A few meters to go. And I will be doing exactly 450 kilometers, which is nice in 10 hours. It was not too cold, it's nice weather for October. Now we will get a hot shower and drink a beer, watch the videos, post something on Insta, etc. etc. Maybe we will see you in the room or I will see you tomorrow morning when we go to different places. Ah, there are motorcycles now. Different uh, passes, etc. etc. and lakes. Okay guys Good morning guys I'm still in my tiny room It's the next day It's the 2nd of October And I decided not to go to San Bernardino I did a new plan Now we are here and we are going through Nufenen Pass and then the old old uh, Trimela here, old pass uh, near Gotthard. And then we go to Andermatt, to Oberal Pass and to this Rhine Schlucht and to this lake, Wallensee. And then we are going back home to Constance and from Constance I just drive home. The plan is to go like 420, 30 kilometers maybe again till home and yeah, it looks good. I cleaned the bike, I put everything together, had breakfast already, it was not too bad. Now I will get dressed, uh, get everything on the bike and we go. It's really cold outside, about maybe 10 degrees, but we will see how it's going to be in the mountains. Still I have to check out the tent, so let's go. Yeah, downstairs 
it definitely gonna wear the warm the warm gloves because we have if you see it five degrees Celsius which is really cold the bike is fine I need a new tire soon but it's okay I will be hitting almost 40,000 kilometers and I did 25,000 since I bought it exactly one year ago in September now it's October yeah okay now we go to Nukunen and then to an old pass and so on so on it's gonna be a new awesome day let's go if it's five degrees here how cold it's gonna be on the pass let's see the hotel was nice but too expensive for the stuff you're getting honestly down the Nufenen Pass it's not too cold, it's already 15 degrees it's going fast really hot to walk around there would be nice, maybe I should So beautiful, look, these tiny roads close to the passes, you go on them and then just ride these gravel roads, and it's so nice, so peaceful, it's awesome. down there to Lago Maggiore through the tunnel Gotthard tunnel there's Gotthard and then you have tiny roads you should always go to these tiny roads if there is no sign because you can have a special view or it can be something special something nice you never stop learning I mean uh, but I mean learning is also fun no yes learning is also fun bye bye, bye. met this guy it's a really nice guy he's gonna fly down from here and I asked about the sport and he gave me some infos because I want to do it also I'm so close to the Alps and someday maybe we'll live in the Alps so why not I would love to fly awesome but it's not the nicest feeling to ride the motorbike there because of the stones tiny stones what do you say how does the bike look with the new Akrapovich exhaust I think it's pretty awesome no slick and this is also better in black and the belly pan as well nah, I like the bike now more than before it looks awesome <sighs> perfect and up there is the Gotthard tunnel 
it's not as difficult as this one it's really easy light turns it's actually one of the oldest no one of the biggest projects restor restoration projects in switzerland the road is originally from 1800 something and how it looks nine now it was uh, they built it like 1950 something like this they let it like with these little stones so it would it would look like the old one it's one of the biggest projects it was in switzerland to build this road <laughs> but look how it goes yeah i remember going here on the nc two years ago or so and it was wow oh, it was hard it was like <laughs> because it's more i don't know it's the harder suspension and then this one is basically like an asphalt you don't feel the difference too much you can go fast actually here on the tannery because it absorbs everything nice there's the main road and then you leave to the secondary road and you're totally unknown nobody here you can enjoy the view maybe stop somewhere to pee and can i write that yes no i don't know looks like i can look where i get to take a picture got hot it's gonna be difficult to go out because it doesn't look too steep but it's really steep here and i don't have profile on my tires i have to go there or maybe there <laughs> but it was worth it look at this place god's heart is so beautiful on the top <sighs> i would like to have a house behind this mountain <laughs> the clouds and pass again because I have to pass here to go to the, my next destination but it's not the worst place to pass let's go to the lake too bad not too bad at all I will have lunch here because it's 3 p.m. already and I need to go home still two hours till home and this is perfect to have a sandwich and chillax a little for the last stretch today's lunch some sandwich coke and knobbers but the view it was a nice break here on Valensee this lake but I have to go home still two hours to go home and it's 3.30 and at 7 we have planned to go play some billiard with friends so I need to go home I would like to stay a little bit longer in the mountains well it was an awesome trip let's go home 28 degrees it's October so nice in the south Germany yeah, in Switzerland but still and if you would stand it would be like 32 or 31 and we are back to Germany back home okay guys I'm back in my village <laughs> it's 5 30 something perfect time I will manage to do everything it was a nice trip it was really nice two days in the Alps in Switzerland I enjoyed it a lot I hope you enjoyed it too and I will see you in the next one bye bye